In today's video, I'm inviting you to decorate with me for the fall. Hi guys, and welcome back to Creative Glam. If you're new to my channel, or if you're returning, hello and welcome. Here on Creative Glam, I love to DIY home decor in and around my home. I also love to do cook with me's, shop with me's, clean with me's and more. So if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button along with the notification bell. Hit it twice so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. Leave me a comment and I'd also appreciate it if you gave me a thumbs up. One of the things I enjoy about decorating my home for the fall is to light a candle. There's nothing like having that fall scent permeate throughout your home, but I also enjoy using my diffuser. And I came up with this fantastic idea to check the notes on the bottom side of my Bath & Body Work candle. Sweater Weather is one of my favorite candles. Of course, you all know that if you've been watching my channel. I decided to check out the notes on the bottom of the candle to see what they were. It's fresh sage, juniper berry, eucalyptus, and fresh wood. So I decided to pick up those essential oils and see if I could recreate the Sweater Weather scent using my diffuser. I got eucalyptus, I got juniper berry, I got sage, and I got fresh cut wood. And I'm not exactly sure, I'm still working on the amount that you need to use as to what will be the top note and what will be the bottom note. So I went straight in the middle and I did about 15 drops of each oil. And I put that inside the diffuser and it smells heavenly and it smells almost identical to the candle so for those of you that enjoy burning candles but sometimes you want to use an essential oil or something a little more therapeutic just a tip that you can actually purchase the essential oils and mimic your favorite candle and then i also went over to michael's and i picked up some frames i love these frames uh they were on sale they were forty dollars each and then uh buy one get one free Plus it was 50% off. So I grabbed these frames there. They were a little expensive. They were more than what I would usually pay for a frame, but I had ordered some art from art.com. And when those came in, I'm, as you see here, I cleaned the glass and put everything back, including the print. And now I'm gonna hang them on the wall. I love the way they look. So I'm gonna use a command strip on the outer edge of each frame, and then I'm gonna mount these on the wall using, using my level. Oh, that is so pretty. That's just how I envisioned it. And now onto the mantle. So I'm gonna decorate my electric fireplace in my dining room for the fall. And here I'm just adding twinkle lights. I'll continue to play with these until I get them just the way I like it. But I love the way it looks. This is what the fireplace mantle looked like before, and here it is for fall. Dreams is weapon love since stupid memes. Close your eyes and then 
just a night away We're gonna set a fire to the night Some bad vibes out of sight The car lights back into the crew We're gonna set a fire to the night Some bad vibes out of sight The car lights back into the crew We're setting on fire Space of a night, close your eyes and dance the night away. We said it's not on fire, on fire. Hey guys, let's connect on social media on Instagram and Pinterest at Creative Glam One. I'm gonna leave additional photos to this video over there. Stop by and check me out, and make sure you follow. Thanks so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed my fall decorate with me. This is a budget friendly decorate with me because I didn't buy a thing. I just went through my fall decor, picked out the things that I'd like to see here in this space in my home, and I love the way it turned out. If you did, make sure you hit that subscribe button along with the notification bell. Hit it twice so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. And with that being said, have a blessed day. And I'll see you right back here next time on Creative Glam. Dance the night